Hey what's up guys, in this video I'll be showing you as how to make your Android device look like iOS. Now for this method to work, your device should have a paid application which is available in the Google Play Store and you can see the application name is called as iLauncher. This gives you uh, the, the look of iOS on any Android device. Now as you can see the dock resembles the iOS look on your Android device and also the icons, some of the icons. Uh, they are uh, they have some resemblance uh, with the icons of iOS and uh, also the transition that you'll be getting out of your device looks like iOS trans iOS 8 uh, sorry iOS 7 transition and uh, I didn't find any lag or whatsoever or any force close by using this launcher on my Nexus 5 and this can this launcher can be used on any Android device so if you want to uninstall an application you can just tap and hold as you do on your iOS device and uh, for instance if I want to uninstall the application the studio application of YouTube uh, or from my device you just have to tap on this X mark and uh, you'll be getting a pop-up message telling you to uninstall this application and you just hit OK and your application will be uninstalled and also if you want to rename the application you can just tap on the icon of the application and uh, you can see you can change the icon change the title uh, set this app as uh, as per your need and also hide this application you can change the title as uh, uh, like uh, YouTube studio you can see the name of the application will be changed so through this you can change the name of the application also and also when you just go into your folders like the, the it gives you the iOS look folder look on your device and also you can change the folder name also by just tapping and holding it the icon and when you go into your folder you can see you can change the folder name on your device uh, like uh, first so you can see you can change the name of the folder also through this method and uh, also you can hide an application for instance if you want to hide an application you can just tap and hold and uh, you can just tap on the icon and you can hide the application your application will be hidden and you won't be able to access your application until and unless you go into your preference uh, section of your eye launcher you'll be able to also access the spotlight search that you'll be getting on your uh, device you can just access you can just type the name of the application and the name of the contacts that you want to access each and everything that can be done through spotlight for instance here like youtube you can see uh, you can launch the youtube application and the application will be launched through your spotlight search this can also be done and uh, also when you go into your preference of i launcher you'll be getting two options available like the personalization and the management you'll be able to change your wallpaper your logo and also the layout option of your icons like a six rows or five rows or tablet mode and also you'll be able to switch off the toggle of transition animation for instance if you want launch an application you won't be getting the transition of ios 7 whereas when you just toggle it on you can see you'll be getting the transition effect you can see the transition effect from your device so this can also be done through your personalization and also you'll be able to change your fonts for instance like you can change your general font folder title calendar date and also the patch font that you'll be getting on your icons you'll be able to also change the font color like you can keep it as auto white or black as per your need what you want to keep and also when you go into your management section you can add a shortcut for instance like you can add a shortcut for your contacts or even your settings shortcut or even your file explorer you can do that through your uh, management section and also you, i have previously said that you can hide an application now if you want to restore the hidden application you can just tap uh, go into your restore hidden application just tap on it and you can see your application will be restored so this can also be done through your i launcher preferences and also you can change the custom font manager uh, for a management for instance you can just uh, uh, do keep your custom font on your device through this option available here so this is eye launcher which gives you an ios look on your android device so hope you guys like this video and if you do please do give it a thumbs up and also do follow me on facebook twitter instagram and also google plus and also do remain subscribe to my youtube channel for the more android content that i'll be uploading in the near future till then i'll be seeing you in my next video